Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. You have seen this look before. I'm doing all my introductions with this look. So yeah. Today we have the Beauty A to C project pan. It's a Fantastic Ladies collaboration. And uh, yeah, we have 26 items in front of me. My table is a mess. This update will go up on the 7th of each month. Um, yeah, my goal is to finish up everything. I have a lot of hair care and skin care. That's actually just and a little bit of body care. But yeah, a lot of hair care, a lot of body care and a lot of skin care. Plus one perfume. So let's just jump right in. For the letter A, I have this Mark Hill Mir Miracle Blues Miraculous Mar Moroccan Argan Oil. Jesus, that's a tongue twister. It's a 50ml bottle. I'm probably done with two thirds of the bottle. I'm right here. I will mark it after this video. For the letter B, I have this CZS body lotion. This is the one I'm currently using. And uh, yeah, you can see it's it used to be quite thicker up here as well. Um, I This scent is so sweet. It's actually quite obnoxious. And I do have the matching um, shower gel as well, which is the one I'm currently using as well. Um, so yeah, I really want to use this one up. Uh, I mostly use this one on my legs because then I don't have to smell it as much. For the letter C, I have the Curl Company Curl cream it's just a 50 ml bottle i used to have longer hair so i had a lot of hair products now that i have short hair i don't style it i don't do anything with it so uh yeah i used to have quite wavy hair when it was longer uh you can kind of see it right at the ends because my hair is cut right at the start of a wave. Uh, so yeah, I really want to try to finish off all of my hair products. Uh, because I don't use them. They just take up space. So yeah, this is just a 50ml one. It's not too big, uh, but I do think it will take some time. Then we have a self tanner slash a body lotion for the letter D. It's the Dub Dermaspa Summer Revive Body Lotion. This one, um, at the moment, I'm only using it on my arms because that's arms, neck, upper chest, and upper back because that's most probably the part that I'm showing now that it's winter. Uh, this is a 200ml bottle. I just finished up one and yeah, I do really like it. I would love to try, because this is the fair to medium skin one, I would like to try the medium to dark skin one as well, but for now I'm gonna keep using this one. For the letter E, I have the Boots Garden Collection Rose Hand Cream. It's just a 50ml bottle. I have yet to use this one. I have opened it and it smells like roses. Uh, but this is not my favorite uh, formula. I have had these ones. It, I got a pack of three for my birthday a few years ago. Um, so yeah. I will most probably just use them 
on my elbows because my elbows are so damn dry all the time and maybe on my shoulders my knees and my ankles those are my most dry spots and yeah that's where i'm gonna use that one for the letter f we have the curl company hold and body foaming mousse can someone please tell me how to use a foaming mousse i do not know i've never been into doing my hair uh, why i do have all of these hair products i do not know so yeah please let me know how to use it um or tell me somebody who has a YouTube, YouTube channel that can show me how to use these kind of products. That would be lovely. But yeah, I do want to use this one up. This is a 200ml bottle or a 193 grams or 6.8 fluid ounce. So a big one. Then for the letter... G, we have the Revolution Glycolic Acid Revitalizing Essence Spray with Aloe Vera Extract. This is just a 50ml bottle. I just used up another one and I'm currently using one that's in this project. Um, so yeah, I these kind of sprays I use twice a day. Um, both in the morning and the night as my last step in my skincare routine. We will see how it goes. I have yet to try it out. Then for the letter H, I have the Revolution Hyaluronic Hydrating Essence Spray with Pink Grapefruit Extract. Again, a 50ml bottle. Use it twice a day. Have yet to try out this one. Then for the letter I, we have the Budgie Big City Life. It's an um, face serum uh, that are gonna be uh, my morning serums because it's anti-pollution serum. It's so damn reflective. Um, I have used this a few times, but I will mark it after this video. For the letter J we have this Batiste dry shampoo in Juicy and Addictive Potty. This smells lovely. It's the big bottle. It is a 200ml bottle. I think I'm down to right here when I shake it. Um, I do use dry shampoos now that I have bangs and shorter hair so I don't need to shower as often um, I do keep my showering sh schedule to one maybe two times per week uh, so dry shampoo is becoming my new friend uh, so yeah I do have one more big bottle in my collection from Batiste and I have one from another company I do not remember on the top of my head but they will be used then for my one perfume we have the Kenzo flower in the air perfume I got this for Christmas quite a few years ago um, it's a flower on top this is a 50ml bottle or a 1.7 fluid ounce. Um, so yeah, it's quite up there. If I tilt it this way, it's soon halfway done. Um, It's more of a spring and summer scent, but yeah, this one I'm hoping to have it done by the end of the year. I'm not a big perfume girl and I have one that I really, really, really love and I use 
release it daily so we will see how it goes with finishing up that one. For the letter L we have another um, hair product and it's the Curl Company Leave-In Conditioner. Um, I might be around to around here so I maybe used up a third of the product um, but yeah I usually put this in after I've showered um, at my ends and I do have a undercut so I usually put it in the undercut section um, just to make my small baby hairs um, not so hard and pokey um, so yeah this will take ages to finish up but I really want it gone for the letter M we have this Luggy House face soap in the scent mandarin and bergamot I have already started to use this but this is how much I have left uh, it used to be rectangular as you probably can see I'm guessing it was about to out here uh, I use my soaps to clean my sponges and my face ha halos which is the reusable makeup remover pads um, so yeah this one will be gone when it's gone smells lovely and um, yeah then for the letter N we have another of the revolution essence spray this one is the niacinamide clarifying essence spray with chamomile extract again I'm using another one that's coming up later in this video um, so yeah for the letter O, we have the formula 10.0.6 One Smooth Operator Pore Clearing Face Scrub with Sink Op and Pumic Pumice? Pumic? Um, I don't have too too much left in this one Let's see if we can get the air bubble out um, that would be lovely. Oh, and yes, we can. And there we go. Now it's actually quite at the bottom, so this will be my gimme product in this project pan. Uh, but face scrubs usually takes me quite a while to finish up because I use it the one to two times a week I'm in the shower um, or when I'm washing my hair so yeah um, I might have this one done for my first update but it will be done by the second update then for the letter P I have the rituals the ritual of happy Buddha soap bar with sweet orange and cedar wood uh, this is a 25 gram small sample soap it smells really lovely and yeah it's again another gimme product this one will go quite quickly when I'm opening it. I do think this one will be the next one after this one. Uh, or maybe I will have both of them going at the same time. We will see. Um, then we have the letter Q and it's the... Uh, what's the brand? Blue Q. 
Ooh la la, somebody is getting some soap. Long lasting triple milled luxury soap. Um, it looks like this. It's a super cute packaging. It's wrapped in paper and yeah, it's a where it's with essential oils and pure veg, veg, vegetable vegetable base. Uh, so this is gonna be quite exciting, I think. It doesn't smell that much, but we will see. I have had it for quite some time. I got this um, either as a birthday gift or as a Christmas gift from a friend. Same with this one. Uh, but yeah. So when this is done, I'm gonna use this. After this, I will go to this. So that's my soap order. I have two more soaps in this one that I will use after these two. Then we have my last essence spray from Revolution for the letter R and it's the Rose Hip Regenerating Essence Spray with Citrus Oil Extract. This is the one I'm using currently, um, twice a day for the most part. Uh, so yeah, I'm hoping to have this one done by the Maybe not my first update, but my second update. Uh, so done in February sometime. That's my goal. Um, so yeah, it smells lovely. We will see how much it does for my skin. Uh, but yeah. Then letter S, we have the H&M Gloss It Over Finishing Spray. Brilliant Shine Fly Away, Fly Away Control. It's a 150ml bottle. Looks like this. Um, I'm about down to here. So I have used up a fourth of it. I will... Um, again, mark it after the video. For the letter T, I have the Ritual of Tusuru Del Delicate Glow Body Cream with uh, Gold and Pine. This is a big tub, big, big, big one, and it's it doesn't say how much is in it, or does it? Where does it say? Oh, there. 220 mils. This one, I... This one was full uh, when I got it. I got it this year by my boyfriend. Uh, he got me a set with this and a matching um, shower foam gel. Not gel, but shower foam in the same scent and this one is so thick uh, that I usually only use it on my dry spots again uh, so we will see if I can finish this one off this year I might use it as a hand cream when I do have home office um, but yeah body lotions takes me forever to use up so that I have two big ones, three big ones in this project. We will see how it goes. Uh, but yeah, I'm hoping to have some prog progress on all of them. I think I will actually weigh this one because you can't see any progress through the bottle or the tub. And yeah. So I will have the starting weight down below and yeah, we will see how this one goes. Now for my last 
bar soaps. I have the two pack of the neutral, specially developed for sensitive skin bar soap. It's a dual pack. And this one is for the letter U in the neutral name. Um, I have finished up a dual pack um, before and yeah these are the last two soaps in this project so in total I have five soaps bar soaps and all of them will be used for the same purpose uh, so yeah these ones will be the last two bar soaps to go then for the letter V, we have the Derma V10 sea salt spray. Um, this is a 200ml bottle. I have yet to use it. This is brand new. And I do have one other sea spray, sea salt spray in this project. It's coming up next. So this one will be um, sitting on my shelf until the other one is done. Now, the other sea salt spray we have is the H&M Sea Mist Salt Water Spray. And it looks like this. I bought these two together uh, for quite some while ago. And let's see. I have used more of this one than the other H&M one. I am down to here, so one third done. Again, I will mark it after I'm done filming. So yeah, this one will go first, um, and then I will work on this bad boy. For the letter Q, no, not Q, X. We have the OGX Anti Breakage Plus Keratin Oil. Uh, it's a weightless rapid reviving oil. It's a 118 ml bottle. Looks like this. Had this one for years. Uh, yeah. I'm. Maybe two fifth. 40% done with this one. Um, again, I'm only using it on my ends and I usually spray it on my comb and then comb it through the ends. So that's how I use this one. For the letter Y, we have the Philosophy hand cream in the scent Orange Blossom. This is a 75ml bottle. Now I have yet to use this one, it's still sealed, so what I'm thinking is when I'm done with this one and this one, because I think this one will go first out of my body lotions, then I will open this one. So when I have two out of my one, two, three, four, five hand and body creams done, I will open this big hand cream. Um, I don't know how the texture is on this one. It might be good for my hands. If it is, I will use it for my hands. Uh, but I will probably also use it on my dry spots and on my arms. And yeah. We will see how it goes. The last product is for the letter C and it's the Lancome Hydrasan Gel Cream Hydrant Anti-Stress uh, Gel Cream. Yeah, it's a moisturizer. Uh, it's a 15ml sample. Looks like ooh, you can't even see it. Looks like this. It's a baby pink color. Ooh. I have yet to use this one. Um, but yeah, this one I will start using now, I guess. And yeah. 
this um, I do think it will take me two months to use it up so maybe in February or the beginning of March this one will be done I'm hoping and that's my long as introduction for beauty as you see and I hope I will see you in my next one please like comment and subscribe and I hope you have a nice day. Bye!